Hey, Cocoa Packs FMJ. I think that's all of the ammo types now. But... You know what they need? They need to take this tribute thing and make it so that like, you cut off your finger or something like that as part of the tribute. Well, that's why I I initially liked the slicing the hand. Because that's, cause yeah, that's, that's well, like a... a lot of... There's... Yeah. Mr. There's Cherry people. is missing. Well, not only that, there's... One of the reasons why they got rid of it is it makes people want to watch animation. You can skip the animation. And yes. If Yes. I like are, that they changed it, correct. but I wish that they would go back to it because it felt lore worthy to change it for the lore. But even with Mr. Cherry, you go, okay, well, fuck, that event is like months away from us now. Right? Uh, yeah, Devil's uh, Moon. Devil's Moon is what is when Mr. Cherry went missing. Devil's Moon uh, was Serpent January. Moon, and... I think. No, it was. Serpent. I thought it was. I thought it was Devil's Moon. No, it was definitely Serpent Moon. I'm pretty sure. Well, no, Serpent... it, was before, it was before Serpent Moon. No, it was Serpent Moon. Trader's when, Moon when is swapped. when Mr. Cherry came in. Right. That was Trader's Moon. Yeah. So, so, so Trader's Moon was January of last year. Serpent Moon was like March or April of last year. And then they had the Halloween Devils. again, and then the Christmas, and it then... was Serpent Moon that they got rid of Mr. Cherry. Yeah, well, it was after Serpent Moon ended they got rid of him. Yeah, no, no, it was during Serpent Moon. Was it during or after? I thought it was it after. Was, it, it's after the whole the away. whole event, right? But it, it, the whole the event whole is event. him tricking the whole event is him tricking hunters into giving him what he wants so that he can release his monster. Except, well. Yeah. He gets shot, so well, he's yeah, gone. Too. And the lore, the story that they release as part of the event, that is what's going on. But as far as the tribute, the moment it started, Mr. Cherry was technically gone. Gotcha. And you were you were sacrificing bullets instead of blood. Which I thought it was cool. I it I, was, but yeah. it's it's they're uwu bullets. They're only bullets. They're uwu bullets. Yeah, but they're, they're only you fucker. They're shit right on the side. They're uwu bullets. I hate it. They're them. only bullets, though. They're Steelers' favorite kind of bullet. No, Ooh. they're not. <laughs> they are in the shut up. I don't uwu. <laughs> I don't like to shut the fuck up. I, I, do, not, don't, I don't do not call it the uwu box because I am That's not that cringe. Point. And you know That's it. That's the whole point. You should call it the uwu box. You're no, the most because uwu first among of us. all, it's cringe, and second of all, it I, is. But you're I, the most uwu player I know. All, second of all, <laughs> I like culture and languages too much to to know to call call it that because that's actually like an Arabic sort of thing written on the box. But yeah, it's no, it, just just no, <laughs> just uwu. no. You. <laughs> I'm a snake. Yeah, yeah, you are. <laughs> you're, you're, well, my character was. You're the first, most. So. Come on, let's be honest. I'm. I'm what? Oh, God. Who's the most uwu player you know? Oh God. No, no, let's answer that question with a question. Who do you know that only runs Asians? <laughs> <laughs> what the? Okay, wait. Okay, I, I, I actually have a question. Why, why okay. does uwu automatically mean Asian? Is is that only an Asian thing? It, it's specifically Ooh, from it's specifically from lollies. <laughs> okay, I didn't see. I actually didn't know yeah. that because I'm not into yeah. the cringe anime side of things. Yeah, yeah it's a lolly thing. Because I know, I think lollies are like overly sexualized minors or something, right? Like they're like typic. They are typically either underdeveloped or minors. Yeah, like they're like barely eighteen. Mm. Or something well, like just that. just underdeveloped. Underdeveloped just is, young, is the typical term. Young looking, young looking. Yeah, yeah no, yeah. just no. Just, just they look young. Yeah. No, I mean te technically, someone who's twenty five could be a lolly. Yeah, if they're like, yeah, you know, young looking, flat chested, short, skinny, that kind of stuff. Ugh. Yeah, your no. type. No, <laughs> damn. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> What? No. No, no, no. No, kill horse. Now, 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 don't, do no, don't get me wrong. 
I'm, it does protest too much. I am I am not saying that a woman cannot be underdeveloped. Everyone reaches their stages when they reach their stages. That's what I'm not, that's what I'm not saying no to. I'm saying no to the super like having to be young lolly part. That's what I'm saying no to because that's just oof. Oh, no. you don't have We're to. We're not talking that. about pedos. We're not talking about yeah, it's, that. Yeah, it's, it's not pedophilia. Technically. It's not a pedo thing. Oh my god. It's it's a it's a it's a very Look, very fine line that they're towing. Do you like eighteen year olds? I mean, no. No, they're too young. When when I was, or are they younger, too old for you? When, well, it's because they're too young. Because when when I was younger, like early twenties, sure it was okay because that's only a two or three year age gap. But now that I'm twenty five, that's like a seven year age gap. So that's 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 a bit much. I like eighteen year olds. Logan, do you like eighteen year olds? I'm I'm laughing at Steeler going along with this. That's a seven year age gap, knowing that there's eleven years between me and my girlfriend. No, here's here's the thing though. <laughs> I was going to go even further with that by saying I like the age gap bigger going up than going down. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah Big definitely. age gaps well, going this, down made me feel weird. I guess. At, I guess. I don't know. When I, I when I was as like, far like, as like, as, like, far as, as far as them being attractive, yes, they are. As far as wanting to have any kind of relationship with them, probably not. It would have to be the right kind of person. Same, which is why I'm saying, if it's like five years down and it's somebody that I really would like, I would date somebody that's twenty. I'm okay with that. But as soon as they start to get under twenty. That's a little weird for me, unless that, like unless I that, really click well, with that person. Well, here's the thing: that makes sense for the age range that you're in. A seven year difference from someone who's 18 to someone that's 25. A lot of shit happens at that time frame. Yeah. The that's difference what I'm between someone who's 50 and someone who's 43. Not that different. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So big age gaps when you're older don't matter as much. Um, but still, like like what I said, if someone's under twenty, just because of where I'm at, that would be a little weird unless I really click with that person. Yeah, I liked eighteen year olds when I was eighteen, and I'm gonna like them when I'm eighty. Um, <laughs> you yes. have fun with that, yes. sir. <laughs> no, well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. He's not saying that he would be in a relationship with them. I, yeah, I know. So there, I mean, and I agree with that statement. Like, I like eighteen-year-olds when I was under eighteen. That's, That's right. The way that it was, you know. Well, I mean, I second that because I, I've always liked some of the older ones. Anyway, okay. But. Okay. Here's the question then: If you see a girl and she's hot, and you like her and you're interested with her, and you know that she's an adult, well, let's get you know because. You know, if I don't Here's put it out thing. there, you're gonna be like, "Well, what if she's 12? <laughs> but no, are you really gonna care about what her you're, age is or what the age gap is? You're gonna be able to tell if if, if they're 12. There's there's a certain adult well, level that interaction. Awesome. That wasn't the point of the question. The question is, if you see a girl and you think she's attractive, if, if I meet and a girl you're at a bar her, right now, if I meet, are a you girl, gonna really give a shit about her age? If I meet a girl at a bar right now, and she's she she looks mature like she's she looks mature she carries herself in a very mature way and we connect on a deep level if she's 18 or 19 i could live with that because of that connection it would be weird because it's somebody under 20 but if i could say this is the relationship that we have that's better than most people in my age group. Like, it's not like I'm trying to go low because I can't find anything. It's because I actually have, like, a deep connection with this person. Yeah, I would be okay with that. I would be able to live with it. That's, that's what I'm saying, is I, t I typically would not go that young, but if it's somebody that... If I could connect to somebody who's 18, like they are 25, 26, 27, I don't see a problem with that. Good. It's but an that's, agent, nothing but a thing. But that's where that's not usually the case, though, is what I'm trying to say. And but contrary, 
On the flip side, there are people who are my age, or Logan's age, that act like they're fucking 17, 18, and need to Bitch, go fuck off. I know people off. who are 10 years older than me that act like they're 18 still. I work with some of them. <laughs> Satan's sister? Please, there's, no switch, there's no switch that, that flips that says, suddenly you're an adult. Yeah. Not really. You, you, you either learn to be one or you Well, I mean, there is, there is. It's called a tragic experience, but you hope to God that that never happens to somebody, no matter how immature they are. Yeah. Yeah, then then there's that. So 99% of, actually, 100% are just, uh, of adults are just teenagers who've gotten tired of being teenagers. <clears throat> I have been uh, burnt. Uh, uh, dun, bin, ba, dun, ba, dun, bin. Who's duping me? <laughs> who, who are we waiting on? And what are we waiting on him for? Who are we waiting on is a terrible question, Kilgore. <laughs> I expect you to go outside <laughs> and plant a tree to replace the oxygen that you just wasted. (laughs) And I want you to find the tree whose oxygen you wasted and apologize. (laughs) Thank you. I know that was, that was his way of, that was his way of telling me to speed it up, but also defend me at the same time. And I fucking love that. (laughs) That That was pretty brutal, bro. No, we all we all we all, we all know brutal. we all know it's Steeler Dragon ass, Gilmore. <laughs> He's dragging so much ass it's a miracle there's even any ass left. <laughs> yeah, I went to the fuck? ass store the other day and they said they were all sold out. <laughs> it's him buying replacement buns. <laughs> oh, they were god. on back order. <laughs> oh my god, you guys. <laughs> Oh man! I even went oh. to the bargain bun store. Oh boy! Uh, no, not the bargain um, bun store. I had to step away for a second. I legitimately have a nosebleed. Where the fuck did that come from? <laughs> Your nose. <laughs> no, go take care. I don't of it. usually take get these. Maybe it's because all the talk about Asians. I don't know. Oh yeah. I just had a fucking master Roshi moment. Did you say masturbating moment? A Master Roshi moment. Master Roshi from uh, Dragon Ball Z? Yeah, the strongest man in the universe. Yeah, who, you know, literally bleeds bleeds out of his nose gallons and gallons whenever he sees women. I find it amusing. I I hope Steeler still has his headset on so he can hear this but can't defend himself. But we were talking about lollies, and now he has a nosebleed. Uh Uh-huh. (laughs) <laughs> Ironic. Coincidence? I think not. Um, All right. So, are you doing Diablo Four? I am not. I don't know if I am. I have heard that it's a mixed bag. I haven't actually looked into it any, to be honest with you. Uh, graphically, it doesn't seem like much of an improvement, and the only real reason to get it is because of perhaps they made some changes with the classes, how they work and whatnot, and the story yeah. would be slightly different. But I mean, it's Diablo. Who do you think you're going to be fighting? Yeah. I mean, you're always fighting Diablo. You've lost every game. You know. And you know, Diablo 1 was an amazing game. It came out in a time of amazing games, and it stood out. Diablo two, uh, same thing. Yeah, so I don't, I don't know if, because I still had my headphones on when I dashed in, into the bathroom, but in case Loga, Loga didn't explain, I don't know if you ever like know much about Master Boshi, but he always has a nosebleed whenever he sees a hot chick. Oh, no, we, had a, we had a whole conversation. We had a whole conversation. Oh, he does. Uh, about he does. That. Oh, okay. I, I didn't. Yeah, know. we we talked we talked about how it was interesting that we were talking about lollies and you got a nosebleed. No. And then, and then, and then he said, I don't think this is a coincidence. And he said, I, I hope you. Steelers listening. I hate you. I can't talk right now. No. <laughs> you motherfucker. Yep. 
I hate you so much. I hate you so much. That is what not is, fair. Yes. That is not it fair. Is, <laughs> it is so. It is so. It's you so know. That is not perfect. fair, and you fucking know it. A perfect storm. That is not fair. You motherfucker. I hate you so much. That's okay. <laughs> You're just mad because it happened to you. <laughs> no, I had a nosebleed because you were making me laugh so fucking hard. Are you sure it was because of that, not because of the lollycock? Did you just what? say lollycock? Yeah, you did. I, I did. You got okay, that? if we start going into foot noise, I am going to fly to Mississippi hey, and kick hey. your ass. <laughs> Because I hate, no I hate food noise. I, 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 I hate no all of that cringe anime shit. We have been over <laughs> this. I don't uwu. I don't lolly. I don't food noise. I don't any of that did, shit. You did get that nosebleed, man. There are no chicks with dicks. Only. I tits. cannot also express to you how rare <laughs> it is for me to get those. I, I get them like once or twice a year, if that. So a no, that, just, that just. Farther's the theory. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> All right, no. let it go. No, 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 no. I'm gonna move on. It's boring. I mean, I am sitting here with 50 Mikos, so that's that might be what. Yeah. Think. And each of them has a dick, right? And I've. <laughs> I thought, what happened to letting it go? You didn't let it go. I was ready to move on, but she kept going. <sighs> okay, right. so now so now he's fully committing to double concertina? Yeah. And you're I was taking, told that it was okay. And you're taking it the, is okay. And you're taking the the Miko bow. I am proud of you. Only one of them is the Miko bow, but yes. Hey, you know what? That's okay. Yes. 